Hi everyone, Antoinette here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm gonna to talk about the seven universal basic emotions. Universal meaning no matter where you go in the world, you will be able to detect these emotions with people by learning what are the facial expressions associated with each emotion. Once you do that, you'll get a glimpse as to how that person is feeling at that moment in time. Now, back in the 1800s, Charles Darwin was the first to suggest that certain facial expressions were associated with certain emotions, no matter where the person lived. But a lot of the scientific community disagreed with him. Fast forward to the 1960s, when Dr. Paul Ekman, who is an American psychologist, decided to prove is this correct or not correct? Meaning, are different facial expressions just learned by culture, by the people that we're around, and therefore, do they differ based on where you're at in society? So he traveled to the highlands of Papua New Guinea in 1967 and studied a primitive tribe who had no association to the outside world. And there he did his research and found that Darwin was correct. And so Dr. Paul Ekman came up with seven basic emotions. Obviously we have tons of emotions, but these seven basic emotions are universal. And now I'm gonna talk about the facial expressions that go with each emotion and how to better understand these. First basic emotion, and no matter what your personality is, you have experienced this emotion, and that is the emotion of anger. So what do you look for in a facial expression to know that if somebody's angry? Look for the upper and lower eyelids to be pulled up. Look for the margins of the lips to be rolled in and look for tightened lips. Remember, somebody who is angry is going to be tense. And when you're tense, your facial expression is going to be tighter. Second basic emotion is contempt. Contempt is having this dis disregard or disrespect for another person or a thing. Sometimes it's thinking that something or someone is less than you. This is the only one of the seven basic emotions where one side of the face looks different than the other. And what it is, is the corner of the mouth. One corner of the lip will be pulled back and to the side. The eyes may be neutral or somebody may be rolling their eyes at the same time. And if you want to know more about eye rolling, which can sometimes mean contempt, I've got a video above and in the description below, so be sure and check that out. The third basic emotion is surprise. And what's ironic is the facial expression is the same whether somebody is surprised in a good way or surprised in a bad way. With surprise, the entire eyebrow is pulled up, the eyelids are pulled up, the mouth hangs open, and the pupils are dilated. Now this is the briefest of all emotions because normally when we're surprised about something, it's very quick. We're surprised and then the surprise is over. The unexpected thing, whether good or bad, is over. Now surprise can be really confused with the facial expression on the next basic emotion and that is the basic emotion of fear because surprise and fear look similar in the face. Just like with surprise, with fear, the eyebrows are raised, the mouth is open. However, it's a little bit different. With fear, the eyebrows are pulled up, but they're more horizontal. Also, even though the mouth is open, the mouth is more tense. It's, and that makes sense because if we fear something, then we're going to tense up. Also with fear, the eyes are wider because we're wanting to see more. We're wanting to take in the thing that we're afraid of. Now, if you're enjoying this video, I hope you'll subscribe for more videos on communication, leadership, confidence, all from an introvert's perspective. And that would be me. The next basic emotion is disgust. Either disgust at another person or disgust at something of something that you heard or disgust at a thing. What happens in disgust is the nose wrinkles, the upper lip is pulled up, and the lips are loose. 
Now, although we're just talking about facial expressions with disgust, we're going to move back a little bit, even if it's just a little bit with our head. The sixth basic emotion is sadness. The corners of the lips are turned down, the inner corners of the eyebrows are raised. And the raising of the inner corners of the eyebrows is hard to do on command. So when you see that, know that that is a facial expression of sadness. The seventh basic emotion is happiness, or as Dr. Ekman refers to as enjoyment. And that is, of course, you can imagine, it is a smile, but not just a smile with our mouth. It is a smile that radiates all the way up to our eyes, that makes little crinkles around our eyes, which is, of course, why we call them smile lines around our eyes. If you see someone smiling with their mouth, but not with their eyes, then it's not an authentic smile. It may just be a polite smile. It may be a fake smile. In fact, I talked about the three types of smiles in a video. You can see that above and in the description below if you wanna check more out on smiles. If you wanna know more about Dr. Ekman's work and the seven basic emotions, go to paulekman.com. I hope you have enjoyed watching and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel.